Hey guys, what's up? How's it going? Today we're going to go over how to draw a blue whale. Uh, it's the biggest whale. I think it's the biggest uh, known living animal, I think, uh, that's ever existed on Earth uh, that we know about. Um, that, you know, that's including the dinosaurs and stuff like that. It's huge. Uh, but we're going to go over that. It's easy to draw, simple, and if you're a beginner, you will be able to draw this with me. So let's get started. I'm going to be using this. This is a uh, Crayola brand um, marker, and uh, you don't have to use this. You can use a pencil or a pen. I do recommend markers, though, because they are they have this really cool look to them. Um, and yeah, so, and this paper-wise, this is computer printing paper. So that is it. There's a supply list in the link uh, in the links below, so you can go check that out if you uh, want supplies. So let's get started. First thing we do is I'm going to throw a pretty large curve ish and that's going to be for the underside of the of the whale's mouth pulling out over here for a little bit of a lip under under lip pulling down down here one more time kind of a shape to the lip and his eye is gonna be right here, a little beady eye, a little beady eye. I'm gonna pull back around that eye, pulling across here, and I'm gonna throw a fin right here, a curved line over here, in, in, line over here, down. And so now we're going to go to the top of the head. And so the, the really distinctive thing about this kind of whale is that it has very, um, I don't want to say it, like it's got a more underbody than it, uh, like it, like this portion of his body is bigger than like the top of his head. So the top head is going to be like more flat. So I'm going to flatten it out there. And then I'm going to extend it here along its back. Up. Even though it's a big animal, I'm drawing it relatively small on the page because it's, I want it to fit on the page. And now I'm going to continue up, up, Also, if you like learning a little bit about drawing every single day, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Um, when you subscribe to the channel, um, there is going to be uh, three new uh, beginner drawing lessons every single weekday. So that is Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Um, so definitely stick around for that. They're all going to be for beginners. And the topic wise, it's going to be on every single topic um, you can imagine. Um, so yeah, don't miss out on that. Uh, if basically what I do here is worth your time, uh, please consider subscribing. It's not going to overwhelm your feed. So it's going to be like 15 videos a week, right? 15, um, but it's not going to overwhelm your feed. What that is, is it gives you more of a selection to pick, you know, pick and choose what you want. Cause there's so many things I'm going to go over, uh, like different, like subject wise. Um, but yeah, like I said, uh, definitely there's no downside, completely free. So. All right, let's pull up over here. I'm gonna. There's a little bit of a fin here at the very end. I'm gonna pull down, just like that one little fin here, and then I'm gonna pull up, up, and then uh, we're gonna go over here to the tail. The tail fin has a really cool shape to it, so it's gonna. I'm gonna pull out curve, out curve here. Down, out here, down. So we're gonna do that same thing mirrored on the other side. Down here, just kind of mirror that shape over. It has this really kind of cool look to that tail fin. We pull a line here, and then. Down, 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 down. And 
Alrighty, marker is dying a little bit. I'm gonna go over this with a better marker here. There you go. The marker was dying a bit. There you go. So uh, another thing that I, I think is very distinguishing about uh, this kind of whale is it has these kind of striations on the bottom of its mouth. So I'm gonna pull one line here as if it was like, almost like I was drawing a line on the surface. So it's gonna curve with the form. You know, it's just kind of gonna curve along the bottom there. And I think that's a very big uh, distinguishing feature that that whale has. The thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna draw it out of the blowhole. It's gonna be a little line over here. I'm gonna have a curved line here, curved line outward. And I'm gonna throw these kind of, so obviously it's gonna be water, but it's gonna be essentially this wavy wiggly shape across the whole thing in order to create that illusion of water spouting up. And, it's, and there's no like right answer to that. It's just kind of a wavy shape. Um, and then the last thing I'm gonna do right here, uh, I know it's quick, um, but I'm gonna trace a thicker line around the entire border. And I, I do that because I want to, um, I want to contain the line pretty much. And I want it to kind of look more definitive. And I think it looks better with a slightly thicker outline So I'm gonna do that everywhere. While I'm doing that, I'll talk to you. Um, don't forget to have an Etsy now. Um, I just added the Etsy after I hit 100,000 subscribers. Um, I'm gonna put some of the originals that I do from here onto there. Um, they'll be on there for maybe about like 30 days or so. I'm not gonna put all of them. I'm just gonna put a couple of them. Um, I think I only have one on there right now. But, and then I'll put some original paintings of mine that a lot of people haven't seen, um, you know, if you guys are interested. Uh, but yeah, that's kind of what I'm gonna put on there. I think so far, I'm not really sure what else. I, I am also gonna put, and um, you know, this is gonna be like really in the way here, but what, bear with me. I'm gonna put this thing there. It's it's an actual sketchbook that I did, um, where I put. A, this is like obviously a completely different style of art, but it is like the style of art that I tend to do on my own, and I printed it out uh, basically because some people really wanted wanted it for like learning for just kind of just fascinating stuff to look at. I'm gonna put some of those on there at some point. I don't know when, I'll probably make an announcement, but that's a totally different kind of art, but I know some people really like it. It's more like video game art. Um, I used to work for a movie company, so it's kind of like like that style of art. Um, but yeah, anyways, that's kind of it. I don't really talk about myself that much here, so uh, I, I would like to more because people tend to ask and I tend to shy away, but I'll, I'll talk a little bit more about, about um, some of the stuff I do in my per, uh, personal art. All right, then. That's pretty much the end of it. Thank you so much. I appreciate you for being here. Uh, if you do want to help the channel out, if you do want to positively impact this channel, the best thing you can do is to share the video. Uh, as far as the things in the description, um, like I said, there's a free, um, I don't know if I said this, there's a free How to Draw Cute ebook. So that's a good resource for you. That's in the, it's totally free. That's in the description if you can find it. I put a lot of links in there. Uh, I have an Etsy now, the stuff I was talking about. I'll put that link in the description. Uh, and then there's a whole bunch of other goodies. There's certain playlists that I think are very valuable to you. Um, and that is it. Uh, one thing I want you to ask is if there's an animal that I have not drawn on this channel, um, please look through the channel and tell me if there's an animal I have not drawn because I want to draw, I want to do a tutorial video on every single animal ever. <laughs> so like, let me know because I've done a lot of them and it's hard for me to think of another one. So thank you so much. I'll see you next time. If you got to this point, say hi to me in the description, uh, say hi to me in the comments and I will know that you got to this point and I'll see you later.